Hello and welcome back to my Napoleonic France Victoria 2 Ultimate Mod Let's Play. Last episode, we uh, obviously declared war upon the Ottomans to take Libya and also Sinai. Uh, and I've obviously taken control of good old... Oh, the Hungarians have dropped out the war. That's fine. I've taken control of uh, the Italian armies and I'm going to try and cause a bit of problem. I might just... Should I just rush straight to Istanbul for the sake of it? Why not? Uh, right, so we'll come. We'll, we will move on. I don't want to go on full speed there because <coughs> I need to build, build, rebuild my armies. So we need some cavalry. You need infantry. You need a unit of infantry. You need four units of infantry. You need a unit of artillery and infantry. Uh, you need a unit, two units of infantry. You are actually complete. So you can go to Dunkirk. Uh, you need two units of infantry, a unit of dragoons, and that's it. You need a unit of dragoons. God, this is actually quite confusing. Six. You are meant to go there. Right, I'm gonna have to pause it. Right. Cavalry. You. You're actually complete. Go to La Rochelle. You need a cavalry. You need the cavalry. You need an artillery. We'll send you up to Brest and you can meet them there. So why did I get an extra unit of infantry? I don't know but we'll store you in Paris. Another unit of infantry, what? Fuck knows, I don't know what I'm doing. I've lost the plot, it, ap it appears. <laughs> well, I mean, I think we're going to need some anyway. Right, Gaza, uh, you're actually doing well in taking Istanbul, Jesus Christ. It's quite hilarious, actually. Although, do I, in fact, I don't want you to stray too far away. And then get attacked and destroyed. Why are these? Why the fuck are they going? Who knows? Who knows, good sir? Right, you are done. Oldenburg, off you go. Uh, uh oh God, why am I getting? Why am I training more infantry? I don't understand that. What was I planning? Who the hell knows with me? Bit of a lunatic. Uh, where should I store this one, Dortmund? For no, that one. Don't go for the Alps. Don't even go for there. Go all the way around.
Right, that should be fine. Hunger's having a little uprising. It's nice to see. You can go and deal with all them. These have just been f freshly trained, haven't they? So, should be pretty weak. So it's easy points, basically. My thinking. Twenty-five percent complete. This is good. I'd much rather keep good relations with with the UK. To be honest, because we're not very friendly with Spain, Russia, or the Prussians or the Ottomans. So we've got to be friendly with at least someone. What's this about the Netherlands? They're not in my sphere of influence. How the fuck did that happen? Russian Chinese War. Uh, British War of Roman. That's still going on. I'm actually going to subsidise the British. I've got plenty of money and I'd much rather them win. It should increase relations. Oh wow, they're actually willing to. Well, there we go. Look at that. We are expanding and it feels very good. Feels very good indeed. Can we even build the Suez? Probably not. We'll have to, like, research and shit. Right, you, sir, are going to pick these gentlemen up. Suez. Why have they been put there? I don't remember doing this. <laughs> Fuck's sake. Right. Go over there. Pick them lot. It's very strange. Oh no, not Lubeck nationalists. Whatever shall we do? Uh, where are they, actually? Up there. Right. Let's put everyone on guard mode. I only have a little bit of peace in our time, I suppose you could say, where I just sort of try and forge some alliances, because we have been a bit naughty recently, haven't we? And I think we've lost a few possible friends. Um, so I shall do my utmost best to rebuild that, that, uh, oh, is that okay? Yeah, it will be. That'll be fine. I think I might actually just get, like, a unit of them. But we'll get it in, in Paris, seems that we're already actually in Paris. Um. And yeah, so we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven armies. Two decent navies. Even though one of them's pretty outdated now and could do with being scrapped, which is why I am heavily investing in this navy over here. Um, I could do with a colonial army in Africa. Definitely. So we've got 12 transport ships and then... 20 light ships. Well, I want. We'll get another m transport. And then we'll get. Five more of them, I think. Do I want them all in the same place, though, like what I have just done? No, because it'll take forever to build. Silly Billy. I 
There we go. That's better. Can we upgrade anything? No. Um, right, let's have a little overview of our our country then. Because we haven't had a look at our like industry or anything like that. I mean, the factory's shut down. Uh, do we need to, like... We've got plenty of, like, possible brigades. So maybe I should change my focus towards... Um, I want factories first, actually. Let's open all factories and subsidise them all. What even are my national focuses? Encourage soldiers, encourage clerks, and encourage soldiers. Well, I think we can possibly change that. And we'll try and industrialise industrialize now. So we're going to go to for clerks, because craftsmen are basically big in numbers. Um, like they're so, the craftsmen are cheap labour, which is a, which appears to be what we've actually got, doesn't it? We seem to be have a massive oversupply of cheap labour, whereas clerks are skilled labourers, and I'd rather have skilled labourers actually. Did not mean to do that. I wanted to do that. And we are gonna cancel that. I think. And yeah, see, we've got craftsmen there. We've got clerks as well. Two thousand clerks. Uh, and I, I just think I think what I've read is that clerks are much more profitable, and uh, like you can charge the same amount or something like that, and they produce more and stuff like that. So yeah, that's quite good. We'll we'll actually get another craftsman, and I'm gonna stop that, and I'm gonna do it again. I'm gonna stop that, and that'll do. I will actually upgrade some of these. Uh, upgrade a lot, actually. So why not? Got the money to do it, so money must be spent. So there we go. That should be better for us. Bit of extra random prestige is nice to see. Um, yeah, I do actually want to scrap this navy, but there's not much point in doing it at the moment. I don't, I don't see the point anyway. Uh, we've actually massively jumped ahead from the British, which is good. That's probably because of that Ottoman War. Our budget, do we need to like cut tax for anyone? Can't cut tax for the rich anymore. Should we cut a bit of tax for the poor to 90%? Yeah. Administration is on a good 100%. And we can change the voting system. Is there even much demand for it? 3.8, 2.7, 0 0.07. Zero point zero seven. So there's no point in changing it. Uh, Slovakia, we can increase our opinion. How's Prussia doing? Their military is growing. They are at 72 now. I don't really want Prussia to get too big, seeing as though they will actually want to retake all this land that I have just like pinched off them. Even though they never actually earned it, but they would eventually. So I've got to be wary of as well. Is any wars going on? Russian Chinese war which is what is that? Cut the Chinese Empire down to size. Well it appears that China's doing a decent job. But I don't know. Um so yeah, we'll carry on. We will carry on. That's what we can do. And I wanted to have a look at population statistics as well. We've got 19 million and 77 million overall, so 19 million working men. Uh, if I do that, and that's our biggest places Cannes, Calais, Brussels. And I missed. 
Wait, we've got... We've got space colonists? The fuck? <laughs> it's a bit strange. Oh well. What? Oh shit! What? What is this about? Why have they released that country and not just like released Canada? Those pesky Brits and their weirdness. Can do something with the United States, so increase opinion. Which I will actually do. Now we're friendly with them, so we can actually intervene. They are not very power powerful at all, are they? They're apparently ninth in the world. Got 31 military, why are they so weak? It's rather strange. Shit, I, I, I can actually expand here. I'm gonna obviously do that. Didn't know I could. Be nice if like it would come up as like a lighter colour, like a lighter shade or a darker shade or like a, just a different colour to say that you could actually, like a different map mode, just to say you could like actually colonise it because it's a wasted opportunity down there. At some point, I'm actually going to get Madagascar as well, because they are actually in my sphere. And I think I get an event where I can annex them or something or go towards them. I get some more army stuff, I probably should do more. Get breached loaded rifles. Right, I'm going to end here. Thank you for watching. Please like, comment and subscribe if you haven't already and I will see you in the next episode. Goodbye.